Hi. Uh, we're going to add in base 5. I have two numbers here. Same applies to different examples, but uh, I pick this number 221, base 5. Uh, add it to 434, base 5. Notice that in base 5, we don't use the number 5. We use the numbers 0, 1, 2, 3, 4 as highlighted in yellow. In base 10, when we reach 9, we're done. So what we do after 9, if you want to add one more, all what you need to do is you make two digits, you uh, place the 9 with 0, and you open a new digit with 1, and you just keep moving. In base 5, those are the numbers that we use, 0 to 4, that's 5 numbers. Once it's filled, same like our system, the decimal, we open the new digits, we call it 1, and 0 will be in the first unit place. But what does uh, this number mean? It's not 10 as we call it 10 in our system. It means you have 1, 5, and 0, 1s. Uh, that's the meaning of it. So the uh, counting in base 5 as digits, the first will be units, which is 5 to the power 0 value. The second one will be 5s, not 10s like our system, will be 5 to the power 1. And the third digit will be, on the left of course, 5 to the second, which is how many 25s do you have? So counting in base 5 is essential, knowing how to count, how to go from 1, 0, 1, 1, then 1, 2, 1, 3, 1, 4. Now 4 is filled, we can't, so we force it to be 0, and we add one more to the left because we can. 1 plus 1 is 2, and that's right there. Now, let me show you another concept involved here. Looking at 7, for example. In our system 7, Speaking fives, how many fives do we have? We have one five. And how many units? Two. That is one two. Let's take another one. Let's go with sixteen. Sixteen. How many fives? Three fives. And how many units? One. Three fives and one unit. This is a chart also to show you or help you understand adding notice that i'm using different colors because when you add 0 to 0 0 to 1 0 to 2 0 3 to 0 4 it's not going to do anything same idea down this way when you get to more than 3 plus 2 which is uh, 3 plus 1 which is 4 uh, let's go with for example 3 plus 3. Let's see why it's 11 right there. 3 plus uh, 3 is what? 6. And 6 is how many 5s? 1 5 and 1 unit. And that's why it's written as 11. And notice 11 here and 11 right here because the other 11 is 2 and 4 and the third one is 4 and 2. They all give you 6. And 6 is 1 5 and 1 unit. Looking at the last number 13. That's 4 and 4, right? Uh, 4 and 4 is 8. And 8 is 1, 5 and 3 units. Okay, I think we are ready to add. So 1 plus 4 is 5. 1 plus 4 is 5. But we can't write 5. So what is 5? One zero. So one plus four is five. And as I said, we can't write five in base five. We are going from zero to four only. So we write zero here and we carry the one. Now what do we have? We have one and two and three. That's a second column. That's a six. But what is six? Six is one five and one unit so we're gonna write one here and carry the one again now the third column is two and four but we have one on top that's gonna give me what seven what is seven seven is 
1 and 2. So we can't carry the 1. We're done. So what's the answer? The answer is 1, 2, 1, 0, base 5. And that should do it. Thank you.